Yee Welcome back, guys, to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. Hope you guys are well. So, Arthur's got TB, tuberculosis. I was reading the journal off camera, and a lot of you guys have also mentioned in the comments that we actually got the TB from the Downs guy, which we had to collect the money from, like, way, way, way episodes ago. And uh, I was like, oh... Obviously, you know, I didn't even think about it until I read the journal and, uh, and, and you lot are said in the comments as well. So, yeah, thank you for the comments, guys. You have been uh, very informative and uh, some great tips there as usual. So, yeah, please keep them coming. I love them. I love reading your, your uh, comments. Off camera, I've been doing a lot of the exotic combing. So I've been, I've been combing the swamps, going up and down, looking for these uh, orchids and that. So I've literally been going up and down, up and down, up, literally around that whole swamp. So I reckon I've probably got... 99% of the orchids but just by going up and down and this mission here uh, duchesses and other animals I finally got what I need uh, so this night orchids wasn't so bad I probably got about probably 20 30 orchids in my in my bag with this one here so I've got loads of leftover and like extras so we can go and hand that one in I'm hoping the next mission he gives us I will have hopefully the orchids already so I've got the spider orchids and vanilla orchids and oh, there's loads of other stuff I don't know loads of other stuff also, on the last episode, I was wondering why this Mr. Tesla guy, this Marco Dragic, this uh, um, uh, what do you scientist guy, he was appearing and not appearing. I just I was like, what, what, what's happening? But a lot of you pointed out that uh, he's available at night time. Some of you said at night time. Some of you said it was like night time and during a thunderstorm. Um, someone else said just, just go in regardless of the building and he'll appear. Um, and that also counts as well for Henry Lemur. He only appears at night time apparently as well. So, and... Again, a couple of you also said as well, as I, I'm sort of approaching now the epilogue in a way, I've got, I've got this chapter to do. So they advised me to get the Stranger missions done first um, before I carry on with like the main uh, story mission. So I'll do that. So it might be like a whole episode or a couple of episodes of just doing Stranger missions, which I'm happy with that. So for now, um, we can go to this um, Algernon Wasp guy and uh, go and hand our orchids in. Also, whilst we're passing, I put a marker there already. Whilst I was going up and down in the swamps, there was a stranger guy there who was talking to us, so I kind of avoided him. So I might just go and pop over there first of all uh, to see what he says, and then we'll go to this um, hand our orchids in and see what he gives us after that. And then we might do this uh, mare, and we might do the. Uh, oh, there's so much to do, guys. So much to do. All right, so I'm just coming up to the to the hut now. I'm talking about. Here we go. Go away. Go away. I ignored him basically. He had a bit of a fit and he just sort of decided to go away in this house. So let's go and see what he wants. Okay. He's gone now. We go in this way, in his back door. Go in his back door. Leave me alone, mister. No. That's strange. Right, it looks like we can get in now. I mean he was outside oh goodness. He was outside just now because we ignored him. Okay, very strange, very strange. Another thing as well I did spot was Hosea's and Lena's grave. So that was around the swamp somewhere. I don't know where it is now, but I did do a, I did do a, like a little uh, snapshot of it. So I'll probably show you on here. Anyway, guys, let's go and hand these orchids in. He's still going on. That's strange. I don't know why he's gone inside the house for. It's weird. But anyway, let's go here and uh, yeah. So. Hopefully, he won't give us a mission with too many crazy exotics to get. Because I probably spent, I don't know, maybe like eight, like eight hours like going up and down the uh, swamps. Like, where are you? Good day, sir. Oh, Mr. Kilgore. How are you? Well, I trust. I got you the plumes and the orchids that you asked for. You did? Oh, the Duchess of Sorrento will be most happy with you. She's an old friend, the Duchess. Gone to see it a little now, but in her youth, oh, she was the most beautiful 
beautiful woman in all of Italy. A Neapolitan pearl. I mean, even I would. No. Bellissima. Oh, quite astonishing. You're good. Oh, you're 15 very of them. good. Algernon, I whispered to myself. I said, this man has the eye of an artist. No, he's better than an artist. He's a man of taste, a connoisseur like you. Oh, that's what I murmured to myself, and I wasn't wrong. No, sir, I was quite right. Marvelous. How much do I get? Well, I got to ask her. Well, at least a hundred dollars. Mm. Mm, this should set you right. I'm sorry it's cash. I prefer something less vulgar, but such is life. I'm fine with cash. Anything else you need? Me? No, I'm fine. There is one thing. More orchids. Uh, quite a particular list, but once again, I will make it worth your troubles. Okay. It's a little something I'm making for the uh, Baroness von Buchwald. You know how she is. Oh, very demanding. Dreadfully so. The best ones they always are. Oh, Arthur looks terrible. Absolutely terrible. Okay, log. Okay, F1 for details. I'm hoping we got all these. I really hope we have. Algernon Wasp asked for further materials to be used in the commission of Baroness von Backwald. No, we haven't. Oh my god. So I don't know where any of those are. That's annoyed me. <laughs> 20 heron plumes. Heron plumes. I thought we got a load of those, but there were there, there, a lot of herons were in the swamp. Lady slipper orchids. Never, crossed, never came across them. I don't know where they are. And moccasin flower orchids. That's annoying me. I, th I literally spent hours and hours thinking, I got all these, I got all these. Obviously, I haven't, so... I'll have to do that off camera. I don't know where to even look for that, to be fair. Um, so someone said, you know, if I can't find them, just go to a guide. But I'm going to see how much I can do without a guide, really. But, um, yes. What? I don't want to give in quite yet. So it's getting dusk. Sorry, it's getting morning. Um, it's getting morning time, so oh, I don't know up. if that... I don't know if that um, Mr. Tesla guy is still there. Right, he's not there now. So what I'm going to do, I might pop up to this lady over here. It was a Charlotte. Let's go to Charlotte. We can go and do her little mission anyway. Um, and then we can sort of sleep until nightfall and go and do the Tesla mission. So yeah, let's do that. So I'm going to ride up as per usual. And see you guys there, I guess. That's it. Hang on. Show kindness. On a man with no sight. It's that dude again, that fellow with no eyes. With no sight. Blind guy. <laughs> Let's give him a, a dollar. Man. Yeah, sure. Mm. He gets around, doesn't he? Be warned, sir. Do not slumber too deeply. For the man with no nose is coming for you. Okay, I will try to bear that in mind. Man with no nose. Hmm. Yep. Someone said, as well, so, oh, I've oh, never seen a game on a horse like that before. Oh, Someone said as well, by uh, this stage of the game, like keep my honour up. So we will do that. We'll do that anyway. But we'll keep our honour up. Right, let's keep going. No, we're nearly there. Nearly there. Right, here we are coming up to it now. What, what's her name? Charlotte, wasn't it? So we gave her some we gave her some shooting lessons last time. Oh, she's going for it now, look. Not a single one. She's practicing. Which is good. Good on her. Good on you. Oh, hey there. How you feeling, ma'am? Much better than I've felt in a long time. I, if we hadn't caught that rabbit, I don't think I'd have made it another day. Well, you look better. Better and determined, thanks to you. And if I'm gonna learn to hunt, I figured it was. Time I learned how to use Cal's gun properly. How's that working out for you? Well, let's just say my prey is looking decidedly unscathed. <laughs> At the end of labor, we will it's teach to gain you. leisure. Is that not what Aristotle said? Well, I, I don't know much about Aristotle, but um, well, I know a thing or two about shooting a gun. Look, you gotta hold steady. And firm. Hmm? You just focus, breathe slowly, and always pull the trigger on empty lungs. Here, I'll show you. 
Just go off now. Okay. Calm and steady. Don't snatch at the trigger. <sighs> you make it look so easy. All right. Wow. You try now. Remember to breathe. Wait to breathe out. Wait to breathe out. Oh, not quite. Uh, would you look at that? I haven't hit one that close all day. <laughs> not bad. Focus on the inhale. Shoot on the exhale. My turn. I'll shoot a few more this time. Shoot three bottles, okay. Oh no, that wretched rat is back. Over there, you see? It's been a thorn on my side ever since we moved here. Kill it, please. Shoot the rat. Oh, right. Where is it? Uh, I got away. I told you it was fast. Oh, Maybe sorry. Turn. I screwed that up, didn't I? Come on, come on. Well done. Nice one. <laughs> What can I say? Thank you. I still have some of the rabbit left that I salted up. Would you join me for a meal? It's the least I can do. Sure. How long, uh, oh, uh, that rabbit must be days old. But I suppose that's what salt does. It preserves it, doesn't it? Back in the olden days before they have um, fridges and that. Nice. I like what you've done with the place. Go ahead and take a seat at the table. Okay. Food is just about done. Good match. She's a nice lady, isn't she, Charlotte? Oh. Rabbit stew. <laughs> well, it's, it's good and hot. I hope you enjoy it. You helped me to catch it, after all. <coughs> <laughs> bon appetit. Oh. Please enjoy. And thank you again for everything. I really am grateful. Uh, it was nothing. You're a good man. Well, you don't really know me. I know enough. There's always more to find in ourselves. You helped me to see that. My husband, Cal, was such an optimist. I found that to be very contagious. But there's a fine line between optimism and naivete. And we were both born with a silver spoon. Banquets, butlers, valets. <coughs> Sounds terrible. It was just so many people, so many things. I was lost in it. I was crushed by it. My father was very overbearing. Then we came out here, and I got crushed by this. You know, I pictured myself picking fresh vegetables, sipping homemade wine, writing a great novel. But I turned out to be a far more pathetic anti-heroine than any I could ever pen. Oh, well. <clears throat> I reckon you're gonna be just fine. <coughs> Are you all right? Can I get you some water? No, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. I just, um... <coughs> oh god, not again. Yeah, thank you for this. I think it's it's best if I if I make Oh god, not again. <coughs> Stay right there. It's, it's gonna be okay. What was in that rabbit stew? Hmm. Oh poor Arthur. Is this really like this TB? I'm assuming he does get eventually get better. Like in today, in today, a bit of antibiotics and you're okay, but back then obviously didn't have that. My dear Arthur, I have gone out hunting. Not a phrase I thought any pen of mine would ever ink, but nonetheless one I am very proud to finally be able to write. I am so very grateful to you for all the help and encouragement you've given me. 
There is some money in a box on the nightstand. Please take it. I have far more than I need back in the city, and I'd like you to have it. Please take care, and remain true to the man I know you are. Okay. Let's loot the jewelry box then. Oh no, not the jewelry. Is that the did she say jewelry box? I don't want to loot the jewelry box. Bill stack, it was this, wasn't it? Someone said as well in the comments that you actually see Arthur deteriorate. Like lose weight and mm. I hate that. I I'm gonna I'm not gonna well people say it's not a very nice uh, chapter really regarding Arthur and but uh, we got see if we can obviously get through this. Um, so obviously it's daytime now. We need to go to sleep somewhere until night time and see if we can go and see that um, Drago, Traco, Drago, whatever his name is. You know, Mr. Tesla himself. So I'll see you guys at night time. Well, it's night time and and it's thunder and lightning. So I'm sure the professor uh, is there. Yes, he is. So, let's go see the professor then, and uh, yeah, finally, gonna see what he wants. Wow, this weather, absolutely terrible. Yeah, it's worrying me actually. With obviously, with with Arthur's Arthur's um, deterioration. So I'm I'm hoping, like I said, he doesn't actually die, but I don't think he can die. Otherwise, you can't carry on the game. So for now, let's be optimistic, as Charlotte says. I know, the, the building is here. We are we are at the building. So he's probably trying to capture he's probably trying to capture electricity with a kite or something. But well, not with a kite, but <laughs> Okay. Well he's doing some experiment in there. Can we go in here? Let me in. Here we go. <laughs> Where is he? Is he up there? Oh here we go. Here? Hello? If you are here to rob me, I wish to make clear that I have weapons that could liquefy each of your internal organs in turn and leave you just a puddle on the floor. Professor, I ain't here to rob you. It's me. I am. Um... I helped you at the pond. You did? Oh, you did. <laughs> In the buffoon. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I hope I'm not disturbing you. Of course you are disturbing me, buddy. I almost solved biggest problem and you mess it up. Did? No, but I did. I can't get the bloody conductor straight. It well, well, it, it is uh, the geometry of life, the, the grand theory of uh, power. <laughs> it's the grand theory of theories. Huh? <laughs> there is just one more big problem. <laughs> Maybe I solve it, but can't get it right. I don't understand. Of course you don't. Help me adjust these things, and I will show you what I mean. Here, take this. Oh, well, uh... I'm not much of a scientist. Yeah, well, you are an American. <laughs> Science is far beyond All right. <laughs> that. You make a, a fine buffoon. That's Go. nice, thank you. What is he you doing? You have the detector in your hand. The filament flashes when it points at the locations for conductors. Okay. Power flashes up in hills and plant conductor rod where filament goes solid. When all three conductors in place, lightning strikes the rod, and we harness power of nature to make life. Make life? Is he going to be some sort of um, like Frankenstein? I don't know how Frankenstein got his. Um, monsters to life 
But he says make life. Right, it looks like it's over here then. Okay. Place conductor. We've got two more to do then. Right. Oh, it's further up the mountain then. Right, okay. Oh, it's a little thing on our map, so we can... Bang up job. I oh, expect the lightning's striking. What the hell is he up to? He died, right? All oh, right. Yeah, your last assistant died. Of electrocution, I expect. Oh, it's this direction then still. Yeah, that's... Oh! It's a little bit dangerous, to say the least. Probably right, it's like right here somewhere. Okay, so we have one more. And we're not dead! What a bonus! Right, so... Looks like it's this direction. No, oh, it looks like it's this Oh, I see a lightning strike then. Okay, there's a yellow mark on the map. Is that a house? Oh, it's a rock. Yes. Oh! That was close. <laughs> Over here more. It's going. Okay, let's do it, put it in the ground. Right, can we go down? No, we can't. Okay, return to Draco. Dragic. Return to Marco Dragic. Got to get his name right. Look. I'm quite. Oh my goodness, that's silly of me. Oh, for God's sake, really? Glorious day, is it? I don't know whether he's um trying to. Oh goodness me! There's uh, is that a body there? I wish I ever went to school so I had a clue what was going on. What well, now? Well, now I come to second the creature after God Himself to bring life. To this earth, like this. Am I missing something? Ah, oh, uh, the switches, the bloody switches. Okay, uh, climb up there and adjust them for me. Go quick, please. I'm wondering if this guy has anything to do with some weird abomination we found where they how did we get into this place we found some we found like a weird like creature which is mixed which is was like a, a mashup of like different creatures um i wonder if that has anything to do with that right we can't get we have to go this way do we Damn it. so i wonder right. if behind that c cover is another weird mashup of different animals and whatever i don't know i guess we'll find out soon so I'm actually are on a circuit. Click one switch on the array and another might go off. Okay. You want the three illuminations. So flick the switches till that is the outcome. Okay, well let's tell me what goddamn one of these things to pull. I am an invisible web engineer, not an electrical technician. Okay? Okay, you so Let's pull the sensor one first. No. So these come off, so let's just push. I think we just have to keep doing it until they all come on. I don't know. And then that one come off. Oh, goodness me. Right, let's just try this one. Oh, there we go. So that worked okay. Okay. 
Okay, let's go down and see what he's actually done then. Right. I want to see what's behind those sheets. Are you ready? Sure. Second time lucky, eh? Second time? <laughs> More like 7,000. This is my life's work. It is incredible. What? I wasn't expecting a robot. <laughs> oh, it works. He lives! My son lives! <laughs> what is it? It is life itself. <laughs> Morons who doubted me. It is me and you. <laughs> Isn't he ah. <gasps> That's the drawing board, I think. Is that it? For now. I am so <laughs> oh, You just saw creation's second birth. It's birth I of the androids. Waddle a few steps. I have a son. <laughs> I am the luckiest man alive. <laughs> I, those morons! They doubted me. I'll see you later. Yes. Yes. Goodbye. <laughs> oh. All right. Okay. That was, uh, again, very unique. This is what I love about these stranger missions. A bright, bouncing boy... Two. Let's see what it says quickly. Uh, Dragic needs help placing conductors in the electrical fields around his lab so we can power his greatest invention to date. Well, I mean, to be fair, it was a very impressive um, invention 120 years ago today. So let's have a look to see what we need to do now, what we can do now. So we could pop, and we've got loads here. We've got, we seem to have absolutely loads of stranger missions. So I'm looking forward to doing all these. Edith Downs. Oh, Edith Downs. Shall we do her first? I think it would be more fitting to do her first. I was going to do Henry and Amo, um, but it might be worth doing either Downs, only because we're linked with the, the TB and stuff. So let's pop down to um, a Von, Von Haven, is it? Is this Von Haven? And uh, no, it's just for, no, it's just north of that. Ansberg. And uh, yeah, speak to Edith. This would be interesting. Okay, we're approaching Ansberg. What the hell is your <laughs> so five o'clock, five o'clock in the morning now. So the sun is just rising. It's a, it's a lovely part of the day in the morning. If you can actually get out of bed that early, I struggle with it. But anyway, she is here somewhere. We just need to find her. Is that her over there? Is that you? Hey, yes, it is. You want company, boys? Come on. Sure, because I want to be pissing needles tomorrow. <laughs> wow. This is down. We knew she was into prostitution. Just go away. Oh, look at her. She looks terrible. I'm really sorry, but I... Well. Well, you're sorry. Yeah, I heard you. But, I mean... Well, I... I this country... Is man unleashed? That's the thing, and it ain't my fault any more than it's anyone else. Man unleashed? Then unleash goodness, not just hell's feeble brothers, sir. But how? I mean, all I know how to do is fight. I guess I was set free to fight. Where's your son, Mrs. Down? Where you think? Down the mine until he gets sick, which won't be long, given how hard they work him. See. Foreman don't like him, so he gets the worst of it. Maybe I could go. Well, maybe you could just leave us all alone. Maybe. Maybe you could just go fight some other battle. What a poor look at the mind. What a poor situation to be in. I mean, Arthur is just—he just looks absolutely wrecked because he collected money I from a guy. Which I don't think he wanted to do. 
I think he felt uncomfortable doing that. Um, but in doing so, we've kind of wrecked. We kind of wrecked two other lives as well, which is the uh, which is uh, Edith, Edith, and uh, her son. So, is this kind of some sort of retribution? Anyway, we have to go to the mine. I'm not sure what we're supposed to actually do in the mine, though, and find her son. I mean. But it'd be nice if we can kind of give these what give the these two people a better about? better life, a better outcome. Hey boy. <laughs> oh god, here he is now. Hey boy, your mom's a whore, little boy. Why don't you shut up? Hey. Oh, right. oh wow. Who's this, your daddy? My daddy died. And this man, he killed him. What are you doing here? Leave the boy alone. Why'd you kill his daddy? You after his mama? <laughs> Stop bullying the boy. Get out of my business, mister. Leave the boy alone. Or what? Or I'll kill you too. You couldn't kill no one. Look at you, all ragged and sick and weak. Clear off, you goddamn hermit. Clear off! You and the horse son here. Can't even... Can't even fight your own battle. Get off me! Right, that's one down. <laughs> Love it. Now who's next? Let the boy go. Let him go! Come on me. Shame on you. He's just a goddamn boy! But this is a guilt now. Arthur's got, the, Arthur's got the they're guilt. They're gonna kill me. Now I, I got no job and they're gonna kill me. I've got some money. You and your mama can go someplace nice. Well, why are you doing this? I don't know. Listen, take this. All of it. Try and talk to your mama and get out of here. Now run. I'll try. Good boy. I don't want to see you here again. Do not seek absolution. We're doing lost 35. That's all we gave him, $35. Uh, Edith Downs tells Arthur that her son Archie is working at the Ansberg mine after uh, Arthur uh, heads to the mine to find Archie being go uh, goaded by the foreman, Mr. Dockery. Complete within one minute, 20 seconds. Oh, we got gold. That's the first for a long time. Um, so I wonder if that's the last now we see of Edith. Hopefully we'll see him all set up and happy. Nice home. So it would be good to see the outcome of that. For sure. Anyway, what should we do now, guys? What should we do now? Another stranger mission, I think. So we have got um, a Leopold Strauss mission here, but there were some other missions which are now not here. So I think what I'm going to do is, um, well, obviously we can't do that main mission yet. We want to avoid that really. Um, and that's, I suppose, that's going to get John, isn't it, from the from the prison. So we don't want to do that one. We've got Leopold Strauss, but I want to see if I can get those. There were some more missions there highlighted. So I think we'll wait till night time. The mayor for, for definite was was a nighttime mission. So we'll we'll stay, we'll, we'll have a sleep till night time and I'll see you guys in a sec. So, as I thought, we have a few more. We have three more. Oh, it's Edith Downs again. Ah, this would be interesting. We're here anyway. So we might as well go and see Edith again. Um, and then we have also this Ob Obadiah Hinton. So that was a new one as well. So that wasn't there when during the daytime. So whilst we're here anyway, let's go and... Uh, we're over there. Let's go back and see Edith then. This would be interesting. I like to see. I like to see them uh, like a happy ever after. Like I said, you know, it's a, it's a bit of a redemption from what Arthur did in the first place. But right, we're coming up now. But she might be in her house, maybe. Or is she is this a pub here? Is she in the pub? Hmm. Mr. Morgan. You still here, kid? Yes. Mama. Uh, Mama can't leave. Uh, won't leave. I, I don't know. I said I had the money. It, she said your money weren't moral. She said it'd be better to die than to take it. <laughs> Maybe she's right. I don't know. I don't know anything about morals. She's still heading out. Working, you know? I'm sorry, son. <gasps> sorry about all of this. She ain't been back for a few hours. She left with some fella down the railway tracks. I did not like the look of him. Which way, you see? Uh, that way. Around the woods, towards uh, Willard's Rest. 
I'll see what I can do. I can understand how she would not take the money because of the moral. Oh, sorry, mate. Yourself. I can understand how she wouldn't see, wouldn't cap, have the money over morals. Oh, hello, horse. It's gone, you. But she would carry on um, selling a body. And if someone know about it, like, where's her dignity? You know what I mean? Or maybe it's just gone. It's gone. We stripped her. We stripped her dignity from her. Oh, wait. Oh, what's that? Is that a bear or something? Wait. Looks like we are here. Search the trail. Oh, goodness me. What's coming? Is anything coming? Search the trail of the bridge. Is that the trail? Can this be the trail? It might not even be. It might not even be this. This might just be a random horse. Hmm. Well, this is was this was the only trail, wasn't it? Okay, there's a horse up here. Yes, I can hear. That's enough now, partner. Oh, no. You're starting to scare me, let alone the poor woman. Clear off! Who are you? Someone who don't want to hear no more of your nasty mouth. Push me. I'll put a bullet in you. I, I presume Archie sent you? I said clear off before I deal with you. I'll see you again, dearie. Oh. Little sleaze, isn't he? Little, uh... Come on, Listen. you get... Come home. Listen to me. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. You sound like my husband. <laughs> I know. Listen, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for what happened. I was uh, a fool. And I'm suffering for my foolishness. But don't go and get yourself killed because of your pride. You have a son. Mrs. Downs. I'm just so ashamed. Demand us as ask. Ashamed? <laughs> of what? <laughs> you loved him. <laughs> you did everything for him. <laughs> Let's get you home. Let's go. Okay, so take either back. Okay, so hopefully, hopefully now we should give him a bit more money than thirty-five dollars, though. Come on now, boy. Well, you just jump on the back of my Arabian. So it's not my Arabian, sorry. It's my um, Hungarian half-breed. I should really get yeah. some more horses. Really, I've only got the two. I'm sorry, it had to come to this. Stop saying sorry. Sorry, won't bring Thomas back. I know. <laughs> it wasn't our fault that he died, though. So you're sick now, too? And you think that affords you the opportunity for penance for cutting his time short? No. I ain't looking for that. Okay, then. So just forget about me and the guilt you're carrying, because no good can come of that for either of us. And all you can do now is decide the man you want to be for the time you have left. Help someone who can still be helped. Or help yourself. I suppose you're right. Oh, hang yourself for all I care. You're right to dislike me. And I ain't looking for that to change. Okay. Archie should be waiting for us just up ahead. Yeah, he just blames us, but we didn't actually kill um, her husband. He would have died anyway. By the sounds of it. Maybe we just cut his life short. Mama! Oh, oh, you silly boy. Oh, Archie. Oh, we do. Get out of here. Go. Live someplace else. Start over. Here. Take this. More money? I don't need it no more. 
I don't want your money. Yeah, I know you don't want it. I don't. You sure as shit need it. Take it. No. I ain't looking for forgiveness. It ain't about that. But don't forgive me. Just take the money and get out of here. Please. I know I ruined your life. I suffer for it every day. But don't let yourself get killed for, for pride. I've seen it kill too many folk. <sighs> don't say anything. Don't thank me. Just take the money and pack your bags. That's all I gotta say. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. I said don't thank me. Get out of here. Please. Excellent stuff. Uh, do not seek absolution two. So, unwilling to accept Arthur's money, Edith Downs continues to sell her body. Worried for his mother's safety, Archie Downs asks Arthur to head to Willard's Rest to look after her. And we got gold as well for that. Okay. See, I really like Arthur. He is born in a world where he, all he faces is violence and blood and killing. And that's very much the norm for him. But he's had to rise above all that and he shows a lot of compassion. Um, so yeah, I mean, I, I say I really like Arthur for that. He's a nice character. But now, let's have a look to see what we want to do now. We've got a bit more time left yet. So we got this one. Obadiah Hinton. Now what was that about? Return to Butcher's Creek and check in on Obadiah. So that was a guy, was it, we rescued? It'd be interesting to see what this place is all about. So let's head a course. I think you can only see this one at night time. So let's get there quick before it gets daylight. And uh, yeah, hopefully I'll see you guys there. All right, here we are. Butcher's Creek. It's 4.53 in the morning. Um, so let's head down while we still can before it disappears. And hopefully we'll find a little bit more about this very strange place. The Wisdom of the Elders 2. Oh, be gone, sir! Be gone! Not, not, not because we cares not! No, no, but because we cares! What are you talking the about? The demons have us by the throat, sir! It's the darkness! The darkness, it's, it's everywhere. The, he was right. What are you talking about? They come in Help! darkness. Help! They're coming. Oh, what? Help! Search the demons. Stay inside. Keep your door shut. That's the way it goes. Safe now. See if Manji Blue Tick Coonhound. Oh. Shit, there's more, all right. Investigate the bark. Oh, goodness me. It's like, um. Oh, what's that disease that dogs get? Rabids. Is, isn't it, is it like rabies? Rabies? Take the villagers. Well, excuse me, other way. Is there more? I can hear more dogs. There's quite a few of them. Oh god, there's two here. They pretty much die if you shoot them in the ass, even, so you don't have to do headshots or anything with these. It's not demons. It's just dogs. Gone crazy. Ain't nice. Get yourselves home. No, no, no. He said, he said they would come in many forms. <laughs> he, he said? He said his protection would come in many, many forms. forms. 
What are you talking about? It's just sick dogs. Uh, hydrophobia or some other poison. He said we were not to doubt him. No. Get your people home, mister. Then get yourself a gun and kill any sick animals you see. Life will be just well, the fine. The darkness has come for us. <laughs> he was right. Who was right? I was. The shaman? Who's this? Oh, hello. It's one of those Indian guys. Who's this? Thunder and lightning, or...? I shall save them. And who are you? There'll be no more four-legged demons. The curse shall change. The curse has changed. What curse? These poor people. I will save you. <laughs> I just saved them, and it weren't no curse. It's just sick dogs. Dark charm. Possess the woods, I told you. He, he, did, he told me he did. He, he told me. I found mm. one. Oh. Uh, don't touch he it. He found the, the curse. Dream catcher things, so, innit? The woods are full of these. While they remain, the curse will remain. Oh, the curse. Yet the woods are also full of demons. I will find a way. Oh, have I lied to you thus? He never lied to me. Come, Obadiah. Feed me. Mm, so, I think he's you're saying if someone it. destroys those charms, the curse is lifted? The woods are full of demons. And the demons protect the charms. And the charms protect the demons. It's impossible. I can see that. It's impossible. There ain't no demons. Don't disturb the woods. I told you, he would come, and he would help, and he would laugh. Well, yeah, you, you told us. So are these those dream catcher things we gotta get? There was like ten to get. Mission complete, the wisdom of the elders, destroy the cursed charms near Butcher's Creek. Yeah, I think I've seen... So Butcher Creek is saved from a pack of wild dogs, details of the curse on the town came to light. Um... So let's have like our log again. Is that the ten? I don't know if that's the ten ones we gotta get. The ten things we gotta get. Oh no, it's twenty. Dreamcatchers. Is this what it is here? You have discovered dreamcatchers in the wild. Find all dreamcatchers to reveal the secret within. Learn the ancient secret within the dreamcatcher. So I don't know, is this this isn't to do with the um this or not? Okay, so I've just looked at the the map. Um this Obadiah Hinton is is now here. So I wonder if it's I don't know, let's go see him. Let's go see Obadiah and see if it continues with these Dreamcatchers things. Hmm. A bit confused. Like I said, the Dreamcatchers we have to find as a challenge might not be the same thing as this. It might be uh, separate things. Well, we'll find out. Let's go and see Obadiah and um, let's just uh, see what he has to say. Anyway, it's only, it's only here. We're, we're quite close, so we can lift the curse, hopefully. Right, destroy the... Oh, right, okay, they are here. Okay, destroy the, the, the charm. So they're all over the place. Oh, do you know what? I've seen these in the trees. When I've been going around, I've seen things in the trees. I wonder what they were. Another one there, somewhere. It's hard to see. Oh, here's this. There it is. Oh god, there's loads of them. Jesus Christ. One of 13 charms to Oh, it's a hole. God, it's 13 of the bloody things. Right, this might take some time, guys, so I might just skip all this until I, until I kill them all. Alright guys, so I've um oh dear me. <laughs> I say I've got one more to get. If I can not fall over and, and die and crack my head open. Uh so here's the last one here. Let's go and get this one. Alright, I said 13 out of 13. So let's return to Obadiah and uh see if this curse of the land has been lifted. Alright. 
Is uh, is that it? Is, it? is it being lifted or is that shaman taking uh, talking shit? <laughs> Basically, right, guys. Do you need bond with your horse? Oh, that's my temporary horse. I need to sell that, really. Remember me? I help with those dogs. I've been seeing about this curse of yours. Welcome, brother. It's a dark omen. Those charms out in the woods? Yeah. They all been broken. All of them? So I guess that's it for your suffering. Ah! <laughs> it's a miracle! We're saved! <laughs> the darkness lifted! Not saved. Huh? Cursed. Uh. He broke the charms. And the spirits are set loose. Wait, 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 we're, we're doomed then? Hold on. You said the charms was protecting the curse. I said it was a dark omen. I said he had the demon's tongue. Now I, I, I need I need some light here now. I, well, this yeah, shame is talking know what shit. To think. Hey, Obadiah. look at me. Yeah. I think something's going on in this holler, and it ain't a curse. And whatever else it ain't, this fella don't want you to know. Liar! I told you he would lie and dissemble. Something's up, and this one wouldn't be so quick with ideas. He didn't have some clue of it. I have the gift. My ancestor. I got a gift right here. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to commune with the spirit. Dark. Dark omens. Dark spirits. What is he hiding? He, he, always, he always spoke truthful to us. There, there is a dig on the other side of the hill there. There was a dig anyway. It's closed now. He always said something about not going over there. Well, mm, maybe interesting. I'll take a look at that, Dick. See if I can see some. Uh, I think uh, we should do straight away, guys. Investigate the mine. Okay, so let's do that then. Let's mostly carry on with this just to get this done, really. Um, I will have to do short. Well, I think I've got to do short episodes again because you never guess what. I'm on holiday again in a week's time, <laughs> so I got. A, I, in this week, I got. A, um, I'm gonna try to get out the two episodes this week and the two episodes next week. This this week, so it should be done. It should be done easy enough. I would have thought. So there we go, Obadiah Hinton. Let's uh, go over this long. Oh, it's up north. It's further. Okay, it's up north. All right. Well, let's go. Let's go there then. I guess. Um, and uh, yeah, let's just finish off this mission. This is a bit of a strange one. Yep. This is a this is a good one again. A good strange. A good but strange one. All right, there, boy. Oh, look at that there, look. There I remember, I remember like ages and ages ago, I saw a tree like this. And it was something to do with like, um, I forgot what it's called now, like a waypoint thing. Like, a, But anyway, Arthur, he said, if you respect it, Arthur draw, draws on it. So this is very interesting. So I, I've completely forgot about these trees until I see one now. So I'm going to have to investigate that further. Is it like a marker? It was like a marker or something, yeah. and I remember like treasure was was mentioned on the um, when I looked. Well, I looked up. There's another one there. Look, whoa, 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 whoa! Another one here, and we can inspect the tree again. So I wonder whether it's pointing to something. Trail trees, trail trees, trail markers. Yeah. So see here, it's got the trail markers here. So I'm going to do this one first, and then I might just have a look at these trail markers straight after. So let's carry on to. Uh, this chap. All right, there's another one up here. There is another one. Let's go and inspect this one. Let's get on the map. What we can, we'll be passing anyway. Let's inspect it. This is very interesting, isn't it? And there's another trail marker here. Pretty much oh. where I've got to go. So I've already, I've already looked at this one. I can't see on this where it's going, but all these kind of go. It might be, I'll have to have a look. Anyway, let's do this. Let's do this mission, and uh, I'll inspect these trees afterwards. But now there's this dig site around here. Ah, uh, oh, here we go. So I wonder where this is. The treasure is also in here. I love these stranger missions. I, I almost think these are better than the actual storyline. They're all really, they're all really different and unique and very innov innov innovative. 
Okay, let's go. Search your mind for clues about the curse. Okay. Hmm. Well, oh, that doesn't sound very good. Right. Something down here. Looks like there's nothing else around that. Okay, let's continue going down this way then. And there's another branch and path on the left up here. I'm also using my my searching thing. I've played this game for this long. I don't know what it's called. What's this called when you search? It's like evil eye. It's like um, a dead eye, isn't it? But well, there's something it's all highlighted in yellow. They make it easy for you, don't they? But there's also something going off there, which oh, I can't see. It's something above, maybe. Anyway. Let's have a little search. There's, there's some stuff here we can probably loot. Um, and there's also... What did I see that? Was it like a brown rat? So we don't want to pick up a brown rat, do we? We could pick up a brown rat. It could be this. It could be this. This could be the, the source of the... Hmm. This is the source of the poison. Yeah, it looks cursed, all right. So all the money Who's is there? It? I see you over there. The game's up. There's poison in this mine. Oh dear, we haven't been. Oh no. God damn you! I'm getting out of here. Right, so we are in a bit of a, a predicament now. There's a hole here. Oh, he doesn't see. Doesn't look too good again, does he, Arthur? Well, let's have a look. See. Oh goodness me. The fumes are choking you. Follow the steam stream out of the caves before you suffer. Oh god, we're gonna have to get out of here then. Okay, let's um, <clears> let's get out of here. We're gonna have to um, get out of here. Oh, come on. There was some stuff we we uh, we missed. Well, we don't want to suffocate, really. <coughs> this, this is not good. This is not good. Let's lose a stranger here. The last thing we want to do now is die. Oh goodness me! Oh, oh, we go. Okay, we got a bit of negative. God damn. Maybe we shouldn't do it then. I thought we might find something important rather than just get negative. Oh, a gold tooth. Okay, let's carry on. There's something over here. Right, let's just keep going before we suffocate. We can go up this way. Um, I don't think this is the right way. Please, come on. But I literally went up there just to make sure there was nothing up there. A lot of brown rats down here. Right, can we go under there? I don't think we can. But there is a way off to the right. Well, that's the, that's the, that's where we can go out. Let's make sure there's nothing up here. Right, okay, let's get out. We guess get out in fresh air before we suffocate. Here we go. Hmm, have we been here before? Where are we on the map? Just have a quick check. Oh, right, we're by, we're by, we're by, by this Elysian pool, which I think that's where the... Did we find some treasure here? One time. Right, okay, let's just get out of here. We can probably get up there, to be fair. Hmm, I don't know if we can actually get out of there. Ah. Nice little art, uh, cave art here, look. Okay. I guess we go down. I don't think, I don't think we can go up here. We might have to go... Well, no, we, can we go up here? Maybe. Maybe. Uh, maybe not. Alright, I don't think we can. So, I think we have to go down. We have to go down first. Yeah, I'm sure this is where we found the um, the treasure that once, actually. The really hard treasure. 
So we can just follow this out. Yeah, the treasure was down there. Oh, it's down here. Let's go down here. Right. This is where this is a way. I'm sure this is where there were some waterfalls. I think, if my memory serves. Yes, I think we are here. This Elysium pool. Oh, there's two guys here. What are they? What are they doing? Hey, shoot! Shoot! Get out of here! It's safe. Okay, we've done it. So let's go back and get this, get this uh, yeah. liquid we, we collected. Let's get this um, yeah. analyzed, I guess. Yeah, well, we're back here. So who are we looking for? I told you I would save you. Yes. Said I would lead oh, you out of the dark. Talking shit again. Yes, show us the light. I shall. I shall. But first. You have to mark your signs on this paper. It's a powerful magic that will protect you on your journey. Uh, I, I, I hereby will release, will absolve, and, and, and indemnify the aforementioned Roanoke Fuel Company. Stop reading. Hmm? You didn't tell me you could read? What kind of trick you pulling now? Oh, you're back. We thought the curse had got you. Nope, but he nearly did. Don't you go nowhere. I was down that old dig, and I found this. Leaking all the way into the lake. Uh, You've been poisoned. No, no, no. We, we, we were warned not to heed what you That's say. Right. Well, let him tell you then. What's this? It's nothing. Nothing? Oh, then you won't mind taking oh, a drink. Hey, no. hey, hey, hey! No, hey, please! Hey! No! No! no. no. Oh. Oh, you've killed me. I'm poisoned. Poisoned now, is it? Uh, yeah. oh. Oh, the dig. All they found was arsenic and lead. Okay, that's quite poisonous. Dug down into the cave system and spread. I was meant to uh, get you all to go. Uh, oh, is this for the Cornwall? Cool you heard it. Is this for the it's railway to go through, uh, then? Uh, oh, dear. Dear God, there's no arguing. It's clear as day. We're cursed. Uh, it's cursed? <laughs> what are you talking about? Powerful forces have taken on this town. It ain't oh, spirits. Yes. It's a mining company. No, it is spirits. Spirits taken through a mining company. Brothers and sisters, we got some praying to do. Yes. Don't pray. Oh, do something. You'll die. Or you worse. Just go. It's our curse. It's ours to deal with. Now the medicine man left some money. They ain't just take it if you want it. Okay, mission complete. The Wisdom of the Elders, five. Uh, honest. Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell? I was just okay. Wisdom of the Elders, deep down the mine, the secret of the curse is revealed, but bringing it to light proves, di uh, pro uh, proves difficult. I can't believe we just got um, butted, ass butted. Oh, shame is not too happy. That shame we not too happy. I wonder if we should go back to that mine and clear everything out. Well, that's it now. Let's have a quick look a second. No, that's that's it now. So we were going to go and do the um, uh, these things here. Um, let's do it now. Let's just go back and we, I did say we'll finish off this and see if we can find these trail trees and where they go along. So this is the last one we found, which was which was here. So we need to look for something along this like line across here. So let's do that and let's go and sort of do that. Oh, hang on, what we're doing here. <laughs> Right, so somewhere between there and sort of there, or maybe further even, um, there could be treasure. Right, so I'm at the um, the trail tree here, the last trail tree we found. So I've marked on my map, like, there. So let's continue along here. I mean, it might just be well that mine, it's just pointing to that mine. Um, but let's just do a little bit of digging and see what we can find. Okay, so I haven't. I've just keep going. I've just gone the same direction it's following. I can't see anything apart from a guy here. Um, 
So let's go and knock him down and see what this is about. A stranger. I'm sure this isn't what it's pointing to, but... Murphy Brood um, document. Someone pointed out the fact they'll say Murphy Broad, not Brood. Um, Lord, forgive me for what I have done. I could not take another day of torture at the hands of those grubby men. They say that hell awaits those who resort to self-murder. Can that be any worse than the goings-on in that infernal cave? I will soon see. Okay. Prisoner. All right, I'm just going to have another look, guys. And I think I'm probably going to give up in a second, so I don't think anything else is here. Okay, so... I'm literally up here, right? And I've gone all the way up here. I did the marker up there. But in doing this, I have found a flower. Is this one of the orcas I need? What is it? Sparrow's Egg Orchid. Right, this is probably one of the other things I need to get eventually. I don't think this is the ones I needed. Uh, Alright, so we've got a lot of orchids to get. Oh my god. So, I don't think we've uh, found the source of these the tree things. I think it's probably in the cave, in the mine. So, uh, I think I'm going to leave that episode there, guys, to be honest. So, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, take care.